Assalamualaikum and greetings. We are Team Astro and we will present to you Strategic Management Analysis of Astro Malaysia Holdings Berhad. Astro Malaysia Holdings Berhad is a media and entertainment company that began as a paid digital satellite radio and television service. Astro is leading as content and consumer company in the TV, OTT, radio, digital and commerce space, all in one. Astro functions across TV, online and mobile platforms, with millions of registered customers in Malaysia, Brunei and Singapore. Astro's vision is to create an organization that will exceed customers' expectations in quality on-time delivery, problem-solving, service, and cost control. Their mission is to promote from within and help employees achieve their full potential through trainings and empower its employees through incentives for every success. Astro has received accolades for its original production of films, documentaries, and shows, such as Anugrah Screen and Asian Academy Creative Awards. For a decade long, Astro impeccably collected gold since 2010 at Putra Brand Awards. In their technological transformation efforts, Astro has received recognitions as Digital Transformer and Talent Accelerator by a renowned agency called International Data Corporation. Astro has creatively produced varieties of products and services to cater to customers' preferences. Other than the basic Astro package, that is Astro Beyond for high-definition content, Astro On The Go for streaming contents on mobile devices, Go Shop application for users to shop online on their smartphones, Astro Enjoy is their first free non-subscription satellite TV with additional prepaid features for when customers want to upgrade their content's accessibility. Their latest products include broadband and 4K Ultrabox, where customers may enjoy cinematography for four times higher definition. SWOT analysis is one of the techniques to evaluate the internal factor of the companies. By using SWOT analysis, we can identify the best of our company, the factor that can make the company failure, aspects that can be improved, and lastly, to eliminate the hazards that can make the company ruin. Strengths Firstly, is strong financial status. In financial year 2019, Astro had recorded revenue 5.5 billion ringgit Malaysia and it also has free cash flow 1.3 billion ringgit Malaysia. They can use its strong financial status to improve their services. Secondly, diversified revenue stream which are pay TV, enjoy e-commerce like go shop, extra broadband and lastly is Astro Go. This show that Astro did not focus only one market. Fitnesses During current Malaysia's economic situation, price to subscribe Astro is relatively high. Secondly, customer cannot watch Astro during rain because of signal disrupted. This can make customers disappointed. Lastly, based on survey conducted, it shows that Astro have high rate of repeating same program and show. It makes the customer feel bored when they need to watch the same program many times. Opportunities Malaysia is famous as diversity culture country. This can be one big opportunity for Astro to engage more customers by providing multi-language programs for their customers. Astro have really strong financial status. They can use it to invest in the sport of the year event, just as FIFA World Cup or Euro football competition. 
Football is the number one favorite sport in the world. By invest in the event, it will increase the number of customer to subscribe as well. Threats. Since 2017, ASTRO is not the only satellite TV provider. The government already gave the license to other companies, such as Telecom Malaysia. Telecom Malaysia had launched its own TV channel named Hit TV. Now, Telecom Malaysia is the number one competitor for ASTRO. Secondly, almost all TV show nowadays can be watched in the internet illegally without pay any ringgit Malaysia. The strategy that will be choose must align with the company's objective. Even though the strategy is good, but it did not towards the company objective, the strategy will not give any value to the company. Firstly, is transform customer service experience. Customer experience management is a process of the company to monitor and track all the interaction between company and customer. Astro must create value in the customer service to get their pleasure and satisfaction and fulfill their need to earn their loyalty when as to manage to fulfill all the customer needs the customer will remain loyal to use as well products and services specific training need to be provided to improve the customer interaction the best way to keep existing customers is to invest more to customer by offer products and support services required by the customer for example, the existing customers can upgrade their products with special price. A pastel analysis is a framework or tool used by marketers to analyze and monitor the macro-environmental, external marketing environment factors that have an impact on an organization, the result of which is used to identify traits and weaknesses which are used in a SWOT analysis. First, political factors. It is hard to get a license in TV industry. The law and regulation are the big barriers to get the ownership TV industry. Second, economic factors. TV industry that provides low price and bigger promotion package will be a competitive advantage, especially during the economic recession. Next, social cultural factors. We can say that the most of Malaysian like to watch sport competition. TV industry that provides sport channel can capture the preference of Malaysian. In technological factors, TV industry which has the satellite dish will get the competitive advantage. This is because satellite dishes use the materials that will reduce rain feed. In environment factors, using natural assets just like the vitality and the water in our house company day-to-day -day exercises and remain mindful of and endeavor for to decrease our natural effect through a more economical approach hands on the environment. Last but not least, legal factors. Legitimate components include health and security break-even with openings, publicizing measures, customer and legal rights, item labeling and item security. On the off chance that an organization exchanges universally, this will be ended up a really troublesome wrench to urge right, as each nation has its claim set of rules and directions. Strategy evolution by improved new technology and innovation. First, migrate to internet and broadband IP-based services to gain more interaction with customers. Second, Astro should always alert and effectively respond to threats and disruption. Next, TV industry needs to adopt integrated directions for technology development, products and services in order to support strategic plans and upgrading facilities and equipment. Astro also can test the business continuity plans through simulation exercise coupled with a fit-for-purpose insurance program to mitigate 
potential business loss and also prevent piracy trades. Ladies and gentlemen, how does ESRO ensure the implementation of the plan strategies? ESRO did it through corporate governance. It governs the whole business affairs from strategy formulation to implementation. The MCCG 2017 by Security Commission has three principles and they are all followed by ESTRO. First principle A is Port Direct Leadership and Effectiveness. Principle B, Effective Audit and Risk Management. Principle C, Integrity in Corporate Reporting and Meaningful Relationship with Stakeholders. The ESTRO Corporate Governance Framework followed these three principles and it outlines the whole structure and entrusted the board of directors to play the controlling and monitoring role. The board is responsible for overseeing the management and business affairs of the group, including a making major policy decisions. It is supported by four board committees, namely ARC, NCGC, RC and SBTC within the scope of responsibility set out in their respective term of condition. The board has delegated the day-to-day -day management of the business to the CEO within the approved limit of authority and a document uh, outlining the decision-making authority of the CEO and the senior leadership. Where and when does the board implement the strategy? Board of Director manages corporate governance through these activities. Annual board meeting, induction and continuous education, code of business ethics, risk management, and lastly, annual general meetings. These are the activities taken by the board to ensure the implementation of the strategies are aligned and controlled. We have successfully demonstrated strategic management tools such as SWOT and PESTEL to analyze ESTRO's business environment. ESTRO's strategic management practices include formulating strategic pillars, solid corporate governance, periodical meetings, educational programs for directors, strong ethics and policy, and effective risk management. Our recommendations for ESTRO is to thrive on year 2020 is that they should maintain and sustain leadership in vernacular content, sell cheaper broadbands and develop faster connectivity system, commit to research in technology such as cloud technology and intelligent digital analytics provide irresistible rewards on astro loyalty program and continuous efforts on environmental initiatives now that sums up our strategic management analysis on astro malaysia holdings berhad thank you for watching